Hello, beautiful internet family. My name is Dan Davis, and I'm the creative director here at danstube.tv, as well as the Fearless Drone Academy, which is the ultimate online drone course for beginners. Today's video is not a drone video, which is a little weird, a little out of character for me, uh, but this is something I'm passionate about, and it's something that's actually really useful for people uh, that do have sore muscles, or people out there that have been interested in a massage gun. This is probably one of the coolest massage guns I've used purely because of its size and portability and also because you can use a power bank to charge it while you're on the run. So this is the C2 massage gun from Bob and Brad. Really, really nice box. And once you open it up, you get almost a Mavic-esque uh, for people out there who enjoy their drones, which I'm sure a few of you do if you're on this channel. Uh, very similar to the Mavic Mini box as well as the uh, Mini SE box. Really nice handle on top here, built perfectly. It does remind me a lot of the uh, Mavic Mini uh, case, which is actually really cool. And then as you open it up, you've got the Bob and Brad branding in the top corner here. As you open it up, you have a nicely packaged massage gun with all of the different heads. So you get five different heads here. Uh, you get the massage gun, you get a booklet, um, as well as a charging cable as well. And you'll notice the first thing is that the massage gun is actually really tiny, compact, portable, and lightweight. This is the standout kind of feature, I guess, of the C2 massage gun, having such a tiny footprint, um, but also being weighted nicely. Like there's a lot of weight up here, but they've also weighted it nicely. So it just feels perfect in your hand. Um, perfect little like drill size. And then obviously you have those five attachments that you can chuck into the front there. But that is the first thing I really love about this. If you hold a massage gun for a while, if you're using it, it can become quite heavy or it can become quite awkward, even though you're trying to relax this side of your body, this hand and this arm's doing all the work trying to hold it up and move it up and down. So to have something that's lightweight but still powerful uh, is really, really cool. I will have a link in the description below to check out the C2 massage gun. It's actually a very well-priced massage gun. And if you haven't owned one before, you wanna get into the market, uh, maybe you know, you're starting to get into the gym and you're noticing you're really fatigued, your muscles are really sore, you've got into maybe running or swimming or something where you're feeling relatively exhausted but you maybe don't have the money to go and get regular massages. A massage gun is a really nice way um, to relieve some of that muscle pain and tension uh, just at home, you know, on your own. It's really that simple to do it. And I love just the overall design of this system here. It's so easy. Like you literally just power it on by pressing and holding and it will start straight away. You've got five different modes. One, two, three, four, five. And listen to that on the mic. Whew, this thing is powerful. <laughs> you probably don't want to start out at uh, level five. But the thing that's really cool, as you can see, is so lightweight, portable, and uh, easy to just chuck in different attachments. So I can chuck in like the ball head here, push it in, and then once I start, we're ready to go straight away. I mean, that's just one function, but the fact that it's that simple to set up is, is really, really nice. I do like that. Um, so then once you've, say, powered it down for the day, and maybe you're traveling, you're out and about on the road, the thing that's really cool is, like I mentioned before, you can actually use a portable power bank. So this little one here, this is a 10,000 milliamp hour power bank. So it's just a USB cable, USB-C cable, the USB-A. I can plug that in and it will immediately start charging my massage gun. So that's really handy to be able to have that. You know, if you're in your car and you have a USB-C to USB-A and then you've got the uh, cigarette port, whatever you want to call that thing, plugged into your car, you can charge your massage gun while you're out and about. So then you can kind of keep it with you in your gym bag or wherever you want to keep it. Um, and really cool, I love that. Not everything can actually work from a power bank. So that's a really nice uh, addition here. Another really cool feature of this mini massage gun is the performance that you can get out of it. So it's got quite a large capacity battery at 2,500 milliamp hours. And they're saying that it's actually um, battery cells supplied to Tesla for long life and security. Um, so these are original battery cells supplied to Tesla and uh, really reliable battery life. I have used this for an extended period of time, never have issues with battery life. If you just occasionally charge it every couple of days, you know, you're never gonna have issues with it. After working out regularly, you use it and you don't even notice it dropping down in battery. You could probably get like a solid week and a bit if you're only just using it here and there. And then you can just plug it in at the end of the week to charge it for the next week. It's got amazing battery life. 
It's also extremely well designed in the sense that it's using brushless motors here and it's extremely quiet. You know, even though you can hear it when it's on, the actual machine itself is relatively quiet considering it's pumping out a lot of power. So to have a compact uh, little massage gun that actually has decent battery life and is still really powerful is nice to have. Uh, and then the other five heads that you have is you kind of have like this compression head, which I actually really like this one. This is probably one of my favorite ones. And you can literally just push it in and you're ready to go with the, you know, the next attachment that you've got set up. You can have the little pronged one, which is quite nice to kind of hit two pressure points or on your shoulders. You've got the little stopper, little door stopper, whatever you want to call this one. In the booklet itself, it kind of explains what they're each, you know, what they're all for and how you can utilize them. And then you've got this interesting little bullet design here. So they're the five different heads there. And so easy, as you can see, to just swap between heads. You can just kind of get used to it, have a look through the actual booklet to see what they recommend and just kind of go by feel, you know, like whatever setting seems to feel the best for you, whether that's a lower setting to start off, whether you want to kind of go up and see how you feel on the second or the third setting. Uh, the fifth setting is quite full on, like you can definitely notice, like that's good, that's, that's the fourth setting. The fifth setting kind of vibrates your whole body. It's something to get used to. Definitely is some like deep uh, massaging techniques here, which is, which is obviously really nice as well. Another really cool thing is the smart chip that they've got built into this unit here. So it means that you can't use it for over 10 minutes consistently without it powering down. So you might accidentally turn it on, leave it somewhere. It's going to power down after 10 minutes. But the other reason for that is so that you don't focus on one area for an extended period of time and like injure yourself. So they've actually thought about that and put a 10 minute limit on it so that the unit itself will shut down, let you know, okay, you probably should move on to a different part of your body. And then you can just power it back on again with a simple tap. There's not too much else to a massage gun. It really is what you see. It has five different attachment pieces. Um, it's a nice ergonomic design. You can plug it in USB-C, charge it on the go, charge it from a mains unit, however you want to do that. The actual materials that are used here are really nice. Like it's kind of a matte kind of finish with metal um, up on the actual motor section or the where all the internals would be up here. Little metal head for the attachment piece. And then all the other heads are all basically plastic. But I love that matte finish that they've gone for. It definitely does seem like a little bit of a fingerprint magnet, um, but you can definitely wipe that off nice and easily. It's just if you're kind of holding it for an extended period of time, you're gonna see some greasy marks there, but nice and easy to wipe down after quick use. I would say that the C2 massage gun from Bob and Brad is a must have, especially for those people out there that want to get into this space. Um, let me know though in the comments below, if you do check it out, I will have those links below. Uh, I'll have a pinned comment as well as in the video description, I'll have a link to check this specific product out here. Um, but really cool to get you into the massage gun world and such a powerful little unit that will last you for years. Like the fact that it's got uh, such a reliable build, it's got Tesla batteries in there, like it's a really, really solid build here and um, something that's worthwhile checking out. So anyway, guys, that is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you in the next one and have a fantastic day. Peace.